Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today is the question is a vitic reaction. It's a very important method of the preparation of alkene. How the alkenes are manufactured by the witting process is on. Here any of the carbonyl compound. Carbonyl compound means it may be a aldehyde or it may be a ketone. If I suppose to take it as a H that we call as aldehyde. Instead of H if I represented by R that we call as a ketone. That's what we call it is a simply carbonyl compound. Carbonyl compound is reacting with a triphenyl phosphorus elide. Very important. That is a Witting reagent. That simply it is also called as a elide. This one is a carbonyl compound. This one is elide. How we can imagine the products in the Witting reaction? How the alkenes are manufactured is like this. R C if it is a H is there that we call aldehyde, if the R dash is there that we call as a ketone and here is a CH2, hence the formed one is a unsaturated hydrocarbon alkene as well as triphenyl phosphorus oxide is a formed byproduct. Now what the mechanism that is justifies the above reaction, the step one is a, how it's a first is a elide is forming triphenyl phosphorus is reacting with any of the alkyl halide let us imagine methyl halide here we know well phosphorus containing a lone pair of electron being 15th group element and which makes a bond as a result this bond is polarized hence ph3p bond is establishes ch3 and here is a x minus phosphorus loss is electron positive charge now here in the presence of butyl lithium or phenyl lithium or any of the alkyl lithium butyl is a minus alkyl is a plus here the lithium combines with minus to form lix and butyl is takes up one proton from here in the form of the butane is evolved then the rest one is a ph3p and here the positive charge is there and ch2 minus which we can able to write under the resonance is a ph3 p double bond ch2 this we call as a elide or phosphorus elide in the step 2 how it is going to interact with the aldehyde or ketone is a here ph3 p double bond ch2 is present here the carbonyl compound whether it is a aldehyde or ketone whatever it is doesn't matter Hence, how the intermediate cyclic transition state is forming is a, here these electrons are moving like this, 2 comma 2 addition that is, hence PH3 P double bond becomes single bond and the no bond becomes single bond, here is a R and H, here the double bond becomes single bond, no bond is a single bond, that is a cyclic transition state is an intermediate, immediately it, the bonds are broken down to form CH2 double bond C, R and H alkene is one formed and the remaining one is a PH3 P double bond O triphenyl phosphorus oxide is a formed one. Now the examples regarding Wittig reaction here the carbonyl compound is in the form of the formaldehyde or methanol is given simply break the bonds like this and what the formed one ethylene or ethene here acetaldehyde is given simply break the molecule in order to prepare one carbon additional or required number of the carbons containing alkene this method is useful 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 to butene and here is acetone carbonyl compound in the form of the ketone propanone is given hence yet the formed one 2 comma 3 dimethyl 2 between is formed one here the benzaldehyde is given benzaldehyde simply remove the water remove that's a phosphorus triphenyl phosphorus oxide here the acetophenone is given like this simply remove a phosphorus oxide then the rest of the formed products we need to represent now another examples making use of the triphenyl phosphorus elide substituted is taken when it is reacted with ketene isocyanate nitroso compound imide etc here whatever is that 
that we need to break the bonds this is the bonds are broken hence what should be the formed product r2 dash c double bond c and double bond c r2 here isocyanate is given here is also the bonds are broken and which lasts with oxygen hence r dash n double bond c double bond c r2 is the formed product the nitroso compound is also given hence here r dash n double bond c r2 is a formal product and here is a imine is given the bonds is broken like this nr is with this one hence here r dash c double bond c r2 is a formal product cyclohexanone is given cyclohexanone which forming exocyclic ring exocyclic methylene group exocyclic methylene group is nothing but here is the ch2 is a formal one making use of the wittig reaction a pro vitamin a that is beta carotene can be prepared with the two molecules of such kind of the a phosphorus ally as well as the two carbonyl compound groups containing aldehyde groups containing molecule is taken both are said those molecules are fused together to get a beta carotene such kind of important natural products also prepared making use of